CompTIA A Plus Core 2, 220-1102, Practice Exam. Questions, 56 through 60. This video is part of our practice exam video series and is filled with questions that closely resemble the real exam. So are you prepared to test your knowledge? Great, let's begin. Question 56. A technician is tasked with granting local administrator privileges to a new user on a Windows Home PC. Which of the following utilities would the technician most likely use to accomplish the task? The answer is B. Accounts. To grant local administrator privileges to a user on a Windows Home PC, the technician would most likely navigate to Windows Settings, then Accounts, and finally, Family and other users to manage user accounts and their permissions. From there, the technician can add the user to the administrator's group to grant them local administrator privileges. Question 57. A Windows administrator is tasked with configuring user profiles for a group of new employees in an organization that utilizes Active Directory. They need to set up home directories and assign network resources efficiently. Which of the following options would allow the technician to most efficiently accomplish this task? The answer is A. Group Policy. Group policy offers centralized management and configuration of user and computer settings in an Active Directory environment. By defining policies, administrators can automate tasks like mapping network drives, assigning printers, and configuring home directories for multiple users efficiently. This approach streamlines administrative tasks and ensures consistency across the organization. Question 58. A consultant's laptop, containing confidential client information, was lost during a business trip. The laptop, secured with just a basic password, poses a significant security risk. What security measure would be most effective in safeguarding the sensitive data? The answer is D. Full Disk Encryption. Full Disk Encryption, or FD for short, is a robust security measure that encrypts all data stored on a device or disk, ensuring comprehensive protection. In the event of loss or theft, FDE shields sensitive information from unauthorized access by encrypting it with a secure encryption key. This proactive approach mitigates the risk of data breaches and helps maintain confidentiality, integrity, and privacy across various computing environments. Question 59. A technician is investigating slow boot times reported by a user. When attempting to identify programs that start when the operating system boots using msconfig.exe, they encounter a message indicating system configuration no longer manages startup items. Which of the following utilities should the technician use instead to view startup items? The answer is C. Task Manager. Before Windows 10, users could access startup items through the System Configuration Utility. However, Microsoft has shifted this functionality to Task Manager with its newer versions. Therefore, Task Manager is now the appropriate tool for viewing startup items. Within Task Manager, users can navigate to the Startup tab to see a list of programs configured to launch automatically when the system boots up. Question 60. A systems administrator is troubleshooting a connectivity issue on a user's laptop, which is preventing access to the corporate network that uses PKI. Which tool is the most suitable for the administrator to use in diagnosing a PKI-related issue? The answer is D. Certificate Manager. With Certificate Manager, the administrator can access a comprehensive view of all installed certificates including those associated with PKI, or public key infrastructure. This tool enables the administrator to inspect the properties of each certificate, validate their authenticity, and troubleshoot any issues related to certificate-based authentication. So, did any of these questions give you a tough time? Don't worry if they did, it's all part of the learning process. Luckily, Certification Synergy has a wealth of free video content at your disposal. To stay connected with our latest IT learning resources, just give a quick click on the subscribe button.
This simple action ensures you're always updated about our newest video releases. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more great content.